towards him. Jin comes and stands near the boy, then the boy also stands in front of him. Near man asks the boy to tell him what will be the weight of this glass. The girl said, I can tell it exactly but the weight of this glass. Now Jan Mastmi said seriously that my question is that if I keep holding this glass like this for some time, what will happen? The girl said, nothing will happen. Master then asked if I keep holding this glass like this. What will happen if I hold this glass for an hour? Your hand will start hurting. The girl said that the master then asked a question, what will happen if I hold this glass exactly like this for the whole day, then your hand will start hurting very badly. Your hand may become numb. Your muscles may get tense and may even paralyze your hand. The girl said in serious words, Master said very well but did the weight of the glass change during this time, the boy said. No, the weight was big, then why did there be pain in the hand and tension in the muscles? The master asked, because of holding it for a long time, the girl replied, to which the master again asked, now to get rid of this fear, I lowered the room glass. Keep it, the boy said, master is absolutely right and the problems of life are also like this. Keep them in your mind for some time and you will feel that everything is fine. Think about them for too long and you will start feeling pain and these keep it in your mind for any longer that you will get an easy end, she will start driving you crazy and you will not be able to do anything. Master Jean pointing towards the boy said, this is the second mistake of my life and it is important to think about the events but also it is more important to learn from them and move forward. If you keep sitting holding on to one thing, then just like that glass, it will also create pain in your life. If you keep sitting with your past today, then it is still in your hands. It will go away and then you will repent for it from now onwards, so what should I do to become the person you want to be for your past or the mistakes for which you are repenting? and try to become that person from today onwards. Don't make mistakes for which you will regret in the world. Stop worrying about it and focus on your. Not getting enough sleep also affects your personal lifestyle. Due to lack of sleep, there are problems in your concentration and rock power. In short, sleep is the most important thing in maintaining our physical and mental health. By taking good and deep sleep it plays a role, we can improve the quality of our life and live a healthy and happy life. The second mistake is not paying attention to the mantra of food and its quality and never taking anything in how much quantity some people make. They have the habit of eating more spicy, spicy and sweet food. They have developed the habit of eating food made with more sugar and oil. Such people feel that if they limit the food they eat in life, then what kind of life will there be a child in life? What's the fun? As if humans are born in this world just to eat, some people have developed the habit of eating all the time. They keep eating even when they are not hungry. They forcefully put anything in their stomach. As if there is no stomach but a well, then eating anything more than what is required not only affects the body weight but it also has a big impact on the brain power. Consuming food items made from flour, oil, sugar and excess salt harms the body. Along with increasing weight, many diseases start arising which also has a negative impact on our emotions and thoughts because an insured body makes the person's mother also insured, due to which the person also starts getting mentally insured and stressed. Becomes a victim of anxiety, that is why a person should pay special attention to the proper mantra of bhajan and its quality. The third mistake is to rush too much in life and think that stopping is considered. Some people think that life goes on only like this. Wrong running and running, no matter how heavy life is, but wait, if you keep running, you will not be able to get up if you fall, so in the midst of the running of life, take out some time for yourself, give yourself time, try to find which what gives you happiness, what do you enjoy doing. Question yourself and try to enlighten yourself and see, when you do something with peace and freshness from inside, then in a very short time you will be able to do this work. You will start getting very good results, but if you remain devoted all the time, keep running, remain tired, then you will see that too much time is being spent in every task, too much energy is being spent but still you are not getting happiness from within, then run away so much. Nothing is. Not getting enough sleep also affects your personal lifestyle. Due to lack of sleep, 
there are problems in your concentration and rock power. In short, sleep is the most important thing in maintaining our physical and mental health. By taking good and deep sleep it plays a role, we can improve the quality of our life and live a healthy and happy life. The second mistake is not paying attention to the mantra of food and its quality and never taking anything in how much quantity some people make. They have the habit of eating more spicy, spicy and sweet food. They have developed the habit of eating food made with more sugar and oil. Such people feel that if they limit the food they eat in life, then what kind of life will there be a child in life? What's the fun? As if humans are born in this world just to eat, some people have developed the habit of eating all the time. They keep eating even when they are not hungry. They forcefully put anything in their stomach. As if there is no stomach but a well, then eating anything more than what is required not only affects the body weight but it also has a big impact on the brain power. Consuming food items made from flour, oil, sugar and excess salt harms the body. Along with increasing weight, many diseases start arising which also has a negative impact on our emotions and thoughts because an insured body makes the person's mother also insured, due to which the person also starts getting mentally insured and stressed. Becomes a victim of anxiety, that is why a person should pay special attention to the proper mantra of bhajan and its quality. The third mistake is to rush too much in life and think that stopping is considered. Some people think that life goes on only like this. Wrong running and running, no matter how heavy life is, but wait, if you keep running, you will not be able to get up if you fall, so in the midst of the running of life, take out some time for yourself, give yourself time, try to find which what gives you happiness, what do you enjoy doing. Question yourself and try to enlighten yourself and see, when you do something with peace and freshness from inside, then in a very short time you will be able to do this work. You will start getting very good results, but if you remain devoted all the time, keep running, remain tired, then you will see that too much time is being spent in every task, too much energy is being spent but still you are not getting happiness from within, then run away so much. Nothing is necessary, it is just that a feeling of competition has been instilled in a person since childhood by the environment around him and his parents, because there is no need to fight so much, life can be lived peacefully and peacefully. We have the power to achieve great success even by trying comfortably while remaining stable. Fourth thing is to recognize one such bad habit of yours and completely remove it from your life which is the biggest obstacle to your success. There is no single bad habit which harms a person the most, which does not allow him to move forward or pulls him back, because when a person is not moving forward, with time he is moving backward. Now whatever this habit may be, it is power, like the habit of frying less, the habit of sleeping more, the habit of worrying or arguing, any such habit which you feel is causing you the most harm, identify it and start doing it from today itself. Start trying to change a good habit, Although changing habits is not so easy but it is possible to change everything if you have that strong determination and flexibility inside you and if you try continuously then your new habit will be formed and the old habit will automatically form. The fifth mistake is to make bigger promises than necessary. Promise must be made and one's promise must be confirmed and after making a promise, those who fulfill it have a different respect in the society. People like them more but we should never make such promises which we cannot fulfill or which we have doubts about fulfilling. Meaning of eating is that instead of constantly trying to correct yourself even in mistakes or letting yourself fall in your own eyes, be a person who learns from mistakes and moves forward because inside internally speaking ill of oneself and not condemning oneself binds a person in such chains that he is unable to break them and lying there mentally rotting is a relief. So if it is inside we should also know how to say no. It is not necessary that we always look good in the eyes of others by saying yes to everything they do. Try to become, we should also know how to agree. Promise only as much as you can, because if you go beyond your capabilities and give a dog to someone, then you will feel a lot of pressure on yourself, you will be filled with stress and unnecessary expectations of the other person will also get attached to you and when you will not be able to fulfill them, then either you will put too much pressure on yourself to fulfill them or you will become big in the eyes of others, which will then create more pressure in you. 
If it creates stress then do as much as you can, as much as is easy for you, then see how much peace you get. The sixth mistake in life is to hold evil within and consider yourself weak and less than others. If you have the habit of speaking ill of yourself, then every time sees only the shortcomings within yourself. If you listen to yourself every day, then you will definitely not have any enemy from outside because you alone are enough for yourself. If you have the habit of talking bad about yourself then leave it from today itself because by doing this you have made your life hell yourself. Love yourself, cherish yourself, accept yourself and speak positively about yourself. Even if you have made some mistake, tell yourself that it is good that I have realized this mistake now. I am a person who has to learn from his mistakes and move forward, so the you to speak ill of yourself then stop it quickly. Leave it quickly, only then life will become beautiful. Seventh mistake, keeping the mind filled with bad memories and negative emotions of the past. Some wrong incident had happened in the past. I have collected its bad memories. Years ago, someone had said something wrong. Its buttons are still pressed today. There have been two things in the mother's mind, even today we are feeling sad about the fact that we got success inless. When a person carries so much burden in his mind with so many negative emotions, then how will he be able to remain happy and calm, that is why his mother and his mind are clean it, learn from the body. The body cleans itself every day. As soon as you wake up in the morning, it throws out all the dirt inside itself through feces and urine. Similarly, throw out the dirt from your mind every day. Every night, before sleeping, wear the sari. The sari which is inner turmoil, resentment, complaints, clear everything from yourself to others, along with this, take out some time every morning and practice meditation and pranayama, life will become much happier. Eighth mistake and having realistic expectations or expectations. It is the nature of us humans to have expectations, but when expectations are not fulfilled and are more than what is required, then they keep us in stress all the time, make us fight with others and then we start being dissatisfied with our life. The negative things in our life become more visible and we feel that our desires will never be fulfilled. We keep a whole feast of unfulfilled desires on our heads and it seems that we are being weighed down like a burden. We start feeling disappointed with life, water is not the mother of goals, water is not the mother of building good relationships, good food is not the mother of. Leave them completely, then in such a situation, limit your relationships and people with whom you can get rid of. Just throw those people out of your life and find peace in your life. After all this, the Buddhist monk concluded his talk and said that these were some of the mistakes which if you correct them then your life will become peaceful, relaxed and happy again. Friends, another mistake which keeps our mothers restless and restless in today's time is to become a guest of digital devices and social media. Now in today's time, it is almost impossible to completely separate digital devices from our life. But the people who are busy with all these devices, there is no shortage of them, but still they will keep watching Netflix silently, keep scrolling on social media, will spend the whole day in their devices to the extent of madness, this habit is very bad. Do as much as is necessary for you, but it is important to take breaks in between, otherwise it will spoil many things inside you, the glow of your face will reduce and your sleep will also be affected. It seems that it increases the habit of sleeping more and creates stress in you, that is why you have to keep distance from it as much as possible because we can give up some things like junk food but it is not practically possible to give up digital devices completely. Because nowadays everything is related to technology and if we do a complete digital detox then we will not be able to move forward in our life, that is why we have to limit it and not give it up completely. Some things have to be given up and some things have to be limited.